What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back, guys. Um, another vid on Madden 20, second vid today. Hope you enjoy the pack opening. The pack opening was absolutely insane. Uh, if you didn't watch that, go check it out. Drop a like on that vid and this vid. If both hit, if that vid hits 100 likes and this vid gets, uh, hits 100 likes, whoever drops anything in the comments, someone will receive 10k. Uh, if this vid is 100 likes, someone will receive 10k in the comments. And also, same with that vid. I did not announce it on that vid. So 10k coins on, on Xbox. I'm on Xbox only. You'll receive 10k coins. And this video is going to be on... What to do first on EA Access Madden. There's a lot of things that you should do, especially if you're not popping packs. What I recommend, popping packs, if you're no money spent, I would go ahead and grind these solos right here. I'm going to go over them, and I'm going to go over all the rewards. I know a lot of people have not played Madden. A lot of people had a lot of trouble getting into the game. I know I had trouble getting into the game. A lot of players got in. I did not get in the game. My um, I don't know. Something with the EA Access was just off. Um, it made no sense, and honestly, I was kind of pissed off about it, but here we go. So, this is how we start. Um, first off, to grind, I'm probably going to be grinding this. I would love an 86 Baker Mayfield on my team for a fact, so what I'm going to probably be doing is uh, grinding these solos for Baker Mayfield. It's an 86 overall. What you got to do is, um, are these even moments? I don't know. Baker Mayfield made his first appearance in the regular season in Week 3. I've been injured 14 hours. Okay, so it's moments. It's a bunch of moments, which I really like. A bunch of moments. Uh, how many we got? Week 7, we go all the way to week 18. So week 18 on moments. They probably get harder as you go, but think about it. To do these, you have to, you get an 86 overall um, Baker Mayfield, I believe. Or what else do you need to do? Let's see. I have not looked into any of this stuff. Uh, let's see what we got over here. So let's go over to sets. Where the heck sets? Right here. So let's see. That Baker Mayfield in the sets. Or is it just you do the tr you just do the solos and get Baker Mayfield? Is that how it is? Because that's amazing. Um, I'm going to talk about the auction in this video as well. I'm going to talk about a lot of things in this video. So if you're watching this, just watch the whole video and you'll help. So earn NFL. Okay. So by earning 60 stars in NFL Epics Ultimate Challenge category. So, 60 stars, you will earn the 86 Baker Mayfield. So, I highly recommend doing that. So, you get three stars. Yes, it adds up. So, you get a 86 overall Baker Mayfield. So, you will see bugs grinding these. And not only Baker Mayfield, you can also get this Deacon Jones. Look at this. Look at this. What do you think of this? He's creeping up on me, man. Look at this. He's creeping up. This is my baby right here. Um, he's literally just creeping up on me. But anyways, and we also got, uh, a Deacon Jones for doing 120 of these. So in my opinion, I really recommend doing this, especially if you're a grinder, you're going to get an 86, which 86 is high considering Saquon's an 83 and Kamara's an 83, arguably a top, both top three running backs last year. Um, 86 overall is very high for the beginning of the game. Are the moments going to be hard? Probably, um, especially with your crappy team. It might be a little hard, but it's definitely worth doing. Next up, um, we need to talk about the auction because every year I make a mistake, and this year I will not be making this mistake. So this is what I'm going to talk about the auction. So ready? I went on a pack opening. Like I said, if you do not see it, I'm going to go over my item binder and who I pulled. I pulled a $100 pack opening, the grind packs, and the elite packs. I believe that's how you say the pack name. Um... So here we go. I pulled 12 elites, as you can see. So all these elite cards are actually not even that expensive right now. I'm going to tell you why. So ready? This is, I came to this theory. So Madden drops, correct? And um, EA Access. A lot of people get EA Access. A lot of people don't get EA Access. I would say about 50% people who play month get EA Access. 50% don't. So this is what I'm saying. So right now, let's say I pulled 12 elites, whatever. I, let's say I pulled 83 McCordy. I did. So right here, 21K. So what I'm going to tell you is that there's so many McCordys on the auction and there's not enough people to buy um, the McCordys. So since the demand is very low, um, everybody who's trying to sell their cards now is actually going to probably lose coins because when more people get on the game, their prices are going to go up because there's going to be more people buying and more people selling. With a lot more people buying, um, since there's going to be way more people buying, their prices will rise. Um, if it doesn't make sense, you can just hit me up in the comments. Believe me, this happened to me every year. 
Every year, nobody plays a game. I sell all my pack pulls and I sell them right away and I actually lose coins every year. So what you want to do, if you go on a pack opening and you have elites, if you grind the game and got elites for free, hold on to them, wait till the game drops because on August 2nd because you never know what's going to happen. I don't want to sell anything now. I feel like an elite 83 at 20k is way too cheap, especially in the beginning of the game. So just know that. That's one thing I would definitely do. Make sure um, you don't sell any cards. Just go play gameplay with them if you have some leads. Just go play some gameplay, grind some solos. Uh, just grind out the game. That's what I'm going to say. Um, also, um, I'm pretty sure you get some free packs. I actually popped them. You get a gold fantasy pack. I would recommend doing the Cowboys or the Rams because there's a lot of elites on those teams, even the Saints. Um, let's see. We got any free stuff? We already popped this. It's a piece of crap pack. And let's keep going over what else we get. So I'm going to look at some sets as well. Solo battles, I would not recommend doing it yet. I don't even think you can. Yeah, you can't. Yeah, no events yet. Solo challenges. So we got the Baker Mayfield so far. The Baker Mayfield and the Deacon Jones, definitely. The Assemble Your Team Challenge, you get a Matt Ryan. It's not worth it. Level challenges, 3,000 coins, 8 solos, not worth it. The EA Axis, 1,000 coins, 1 solo. I mean, 1,000 coins, you can play. I don't mind that. So Gold Packs, NFL Epics. So... This is the one I was talking about right here. So you get the Baker Mayfield. You got to do all these. And you get some gold packs as well with the 10 stars. So 10 stars, you get gold packs. But really, all those are the only solos I recommend doing is the Baker Mayfield and Deacon Jones. There's no other solos that really catch my eye. Uh, so make sure you keep your cards. Make sure you sell. Um, make sure you keep your cards. Do not sell your cards. Um, let's see. Welcome to Ultimate Team. EA Access. Thank you for EA Access coins as well. Let's see. So we got the EX is challenge. You just get nothing really. Welcome to Ultimate Team. So really, let's check out the sets. Uh, let's see if there's any good sets to do. There's probably not any good sets. If you do the Rookie Premiere, I'm pretty sure those are up. I'm not sure how that works exactly. Uh, let's see. So Mutt Loyalty. I don't have any of these loyalty things. If you have these loyalty things, this is what you get. You get an Elite Offensive Player Pack. You get an Elite Defensive Player Pack. Uh, all these mutt loyalty things, if you got them and you did it, uh, you're lit. Because I didn't. I wish I did it. Um, let's see what else. We got team builders. See, this is actually kind of stupid. Um, I don't really care. Like, turn in your team selector. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll do the Bills because I'm a Bills fan, baby. But this is how you get your team. Um, this is how you get your jerseys and stuff for your team. I'm doing Bills Mafia. Bills fan. The Bills are trash, but maybe we'll actually do good this season. We got Tredavious White. We got we got a bunch of defensive studs, honestly. Our defense isn't the problem. It's the offense, and we actually upgraded our offense with some offensive lines. So maybe we'll be good this year. Patriots will probably kick our ass, but you know what? Can't do anything about it. But yeah, so that's what you get out of the team builder. Mutt loyalty, you guys all know that. Ultimate trainers, did not check this out yet. Let's see. We got ultimate trainers, wild card tokens. How do you get these? I have no idea. Ultimate trainer tokens. No idea. I'm guessing you get it from grinding solos. I'm not sure. If you guys know, hit, hit me up in the comments. Exchange. We got some Josh Allen. What is this? Exchange what? Wild cards. Oh boy. How do you get these? Head to head. Set rewards. The Kyle Murray. Are these all rookies? Yeah, these are all rookies. So... I don't know how to do that yet. If you guys know what to do first, I have no idea what the heck that is. Um, I wish it told you what to do. Rookie exchange, all these rookie exchange cards, I don't really care about. But we also have exchanges over here, 83 and 84, 80 to 82. Not bad, nothing too crazy. Um, the 83s are actually really cheap and the 86s are actually kind of expensive. That's not bad, so that's not bad either. So yeah, those are all the sets. To be honest, none of them really catch my eye. They're honestly all trash. The only thing I could really recommend doing right now is the solo challenges. The Baker Mayfield challenges are definitely the best challenges to do. Guys, stay tuned for some gameplay as well. I need to post some gameplay. I haven't posted gameplay on this channel in a minute. Um, guys, stay tuned for more Madden 20. Stay tuned for more pack openings. Stay tuned for auction house methods, sniping videos, all that good stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, we're going to have a fire lineup. Let me actually show you my lineup before I go. Here it is. Let's go. Line up. Here it is. Best team overall. My first lineup. And it is a 70. What is that? A 77 overall. Okay. It's not that bad, actually. So we got a 77 overall. Not too bad to start. We got 
we got we got to upgrade the QB. The O line's actually pretty solid. We got a solid left side, solid center. So far, not bad. The defense isn't the worst. It's not the best. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned for some gameplay. And that's all I got for you. Probably another video today or tomorrow. And.